wouldn't it? Uh, back with another video. I haven't made one in a while. Uh, just over my first month of uh, hot shotting since I quit my job. And, uh, well, we just made a. No. Come on, Grandpa! Made another. Made a, a load up by the Canadian border. another two hours till we get back home and come on move over oh this guy's gonna mess me up anyways a little road reaching going on here uh on the way back home pickup load, just a uh, uh, small load, didn't even weigh the truck down, hardly even knew it was there. That's the thing about oil field hot shotting out here, sometimes you just, it was three items, and it was a, a head, wash, it's called a wash head, when, uh, when I set it in my truck, I just put it around the, the gooseneck ball like a stump just set it on there it didn't go anywhere and uh, all the bolts for it and then uh, a seal well now we're on the way home Canada's like two miles that way the other night we're out running had a load stopped at uh, one of the uh, one of the shops that we run for on the way back home sat there and was BSing with one of the guys that I know and all of a sudden a call came in we took a load about two and a half hours out to location we got paid the whole time out and back to run two and a half gallons of gasoline to location. Two and a half gallons. What do you do? That day was nothing but pickup loads. I think the biggest thing I hauled that day was uh, a light tower, which is a small trailer. I mean, I got a lifted truck. Not very much of a lifted truck. But I couldn't see it. I could not see it. On my mirrors, over the tailgate. The only thing I could see was the, the actual tower itself. Hot shotting in the oil field. Eh, it's, it's like expediting. You sit around a lot. You sit around, you wait. That's kind of shitty. I mean, I'm used to working 70, 100 hours a week, somewhere in between there. You know, 70 hours is a decent week, 75, 80 is a good week. Anything more than that sucks. It just gets to be too much, but I'm used to it. Now I'm sitting around.
breakdowns. And I had that, uh, that tranny, uh, jump the tranny coolant line, and then a front wheel bearing, front hub. So I'm a little bit more cautious now.
tailgate and they picked it up with the, the winch on their rig. And it was, it was a box with a seal in it and a bunch of bolts. Oh, better slow down. That looks like a cop. Nope, it's not. That's the radiator, but so a couple more hours. That's always good. Easy money. Just hook up to it. Go. And we're taking two down and picking up two, bringing two back to where I picked these up from. I wish I could do it. Just hook them together. That would be the ultimate. That would make things a lot easier. But whatever. It's all paid by the hour. So I don't care. Turned what was an okay day into a much better day. So we'll be close to uh, uh, $800 a day. Yeah, something like that. So, all right, later. And if you like my videos, hit like share subscribe and we'll check out more oil field antics from the hot shot side thanks guys